Hi everyone, welcome back to Playing Mechanic Simulator. Here we are, back in job 3352 for our new pilot, Oscar Wil Wilbur. Um, sorry about it, Pete. Poor Pete, got shot down. I've heard he was a good pilot. Anyway, here, there's no time to mourn. Make sure the new plane is ready for combat. I have a sortie plan for 1 o'clock. So we need to refuel the aircraft, refill the coolant, set up the radio, refill the oil, harmonize the machine guns. I feel like we've already done this one, but maybe not. Okay, uh, we don't seem to have a time limitation, which is fine. Uh, first things first, let us see what we do. So we get the um, the fuel and the... Uh, actually, that'll make the aircraft heavy, but... Um, yeah, that'll be alright. Climb the ladder, and we'll uh, get the coolant cap off. Get this bit done first. Off. Get this nicely done. There we go. Lovely. Grab the can of coolant. Oh, it's been. It feels like it's been an age since I've done any of this. Uh, oh, oh yeah. We have done this. I'm sure we've done this mission. Anyway, we'll do it again. There's no bother. There you go. I'm sure this takes three cans of uh, a coolant. You don't think it will, but it does. Let's pop that over there. Let's get another one. Yeah, I thought I was going mad. I'm definitely sure we've done this before. Okay, two will take us up to the... Uh, yeah, almost about here. There we go. Yeah, I've done this before. Or was it when we... Um, no, because Peter, Peter never lost an aircraft. I can't put this damn can down. There we go. Um, no, Peter never lost an aircraft, did he? We had a, a slight issue with the Tiger Moth where I think when the rookies crashed it, didn't they? And uh, then we had to tidy it up for the next um, inspection. Anyway, we're back. And we're going to be doing this. And we're going to be getting this aircraft ready to go. Right. Drop, drop the can. Drop the can somewhere, anywhere. Brilliant. Um, yeah, good, right. Put that in. Oh, it's been a while since I've done this. I haven't recorded this game for a couple of weeks now. I was holding back so we could, because I did a couple of episodes uh, in advance, and uh, I was going to hold back and then do a live stream, but, um. Crikey, I've taken some time off this week and next week and to plan to be able to, you know, do things. Do things with my time, but I've been so busy. So busy, I haven't stopped, and I've just taken half an hour now just to get a video recorded. Because it's been absolutely chock a block. Hasn't, you know, obviously been, I was going to say hampered, but not really hampered with the uh, U boat NDA coming off, so I can uh, send a video to her at that. Want another video of that coming very soon, so don't worry. Yeah. I, I'm a little bit, I'm kind of holding off a little bit because every day uh, since I've done that video, there has been a patch for that. Um, U-boat game, and uh, there are sometimes compatibility issues with the save, so I'm kind of cautious about starting a, a, a game save just in case we have to start all over again tomorrow, you know? So um, so maybe that will be more of a live streamy thing. Right, um, those first two do set up the radios, yes, okay. Uh, so yeah, it's all good though, it's all good. But yeah, it's been a while since I've... Uh, done anything on here because as I say we did it bulk record last time so um well we've got to get the signal so it's fully right oh it's really hang on there brilliant now we'll move over and get it tuned in you go to hear the people chatting Yeah, we'll go the other way. Oh, there we go. There we go, perfect. You normally go to um, the... Uh, when you hear the people chat and then you do the fine tuning on the bottom one but um yeah we kind of 
hit the nail on the head straight away. Well, that was quite nice. Like, do do do. Those three done up. Right. Harmonize the machine guns. So let's go and put the harmonizing target thingy out first. Because I'm pretty sure I forgot to do that last time. So that should now be out there. Yes, it is. We need to jack up the. Oh, first of all, we need. To, uh, let's jack up the rear of the aircraft. With this thing, which I always find quite scary because it causes the uh, potential physics all over the place. There's scuffs to that paintwork. Possibly, possibly. Right, anyway, um, let's grab this. Bring it over here. Get on top here. Uh, there we go, step over. Grill. Do we need to rearm the guns? We fill the oil. No, we don't. Okay, good. Grand. Uh, so we'll just bring that up. Bring that up, and we'll put the harmonizing thing in. Oh, okay. Hang on. I'll tell you what we need to do. Oh. Weirdness. There we go. Get off that. We need to take the, uh, the strips off, of course. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to see through the guns. So, let's get these all off. There we go. And we can proceed now to uh, harmonising the gun. Now that we can actually see down the, the barrel. Uh, okay, so it's that green one there. So we want to get that bang spanky in the middle. And get this thing... There we go. That gun is perfectly harmonized. Fantastic. Okay, let's get the ammo in. Uh, breach down. Cover on. Lovely. And uh, I suppose we can put the patch on. Lovely. Right, these one, this one. Yeah, it's all coming back to me slowly now. That's it. That's the problem when you do um, a big bit of... Uh, bulk recording. It's grand because it saves you a huge amount of time. I'm doing this one, aren't I? Um, but yeah, sometimes it's uh, it's not always the best for um, continuity for your own mentality sometimes. <laughs> it's going to kind of throws you off a little bit, but that's okay. Alright, the yellow one now. That looks pretty good. Wants it there. Okay, fine. Good stuff. Right, let's get the ammo in. Ammo in. Breach, breach. That on. That on. That and that on. Lovely. Right. Last one on this wing. Breach up. Pants off. Ra, ra, ra. There we go. Um, so, one, two, three. Four. Okay, it's the red one. It is the red one. Do not panic. Uh, super sensitive. Uh, what do you reckon? Down one? Up one? There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Right. Ammo in. Breach down. Cap on. Happy days. Patch on. That wing is done. Wing this over here. Shove that down there. Up we go. Hop onto the wing. Off comes that. Uh, breach up. Ammo out. And I haven't taken the patches off. There we go. Now let's get these patches off. Uh. Lovely. Right, let's go back to this. Get this one done. Uh, so this will be the red one. No, oh, hang on, on this side. No, wait, hang on. Oh, no, sorry, it would be the green one. I beg your pardon. Beg your pudden. I was all confuddled. It was easy to do for my simple mind. Yeah, I, I was thinking I'd start on that gun, but I hadn't, had I? Oh, blimey. Simple observation is not always simple for me. Right, one gun. Oh, and we'll stick the patch on. We know where they've done them then. 
Uh, let's get those off. Let's get that one off as well as we're here. Breach, breach. Ammo, ammo. Right, let's do this one then. Uh, so this will be blue. We haven't heard the roar of the Spitfires recently, which is a bit weird. Maybe they've all that. Uh, oh god, bloody hell, that was way off. Where the hell was that going? It's really. Sh it's going to hit the aircraft behind or below the other. Yeah, the aircraft they're aiming at. Look at that, bloody awful. Right, that's out. Uh, so, ammo in. Ammo in. Breach, breach. And did patches. Lovely, last one. And then we just got to do the oil, and it's another glorious day in RAF, um, wherever we are. I've forgotten. Right, ready. On the red one. Beep, 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 beep. There we go. Harmonized machine guns has been completed. Lovely. Right, ladder out the way. Let's get this thing down. Pretty now. Gotta get it out of the way. Well, the aircraft does something crazy. Good, that's over there. Now, oil. The last job on the list. Bring this old Bowser over here. Look where we're we going. Lovely. Now, uh, it's just here, isn't it? No, not that one. That one. And look in here. Unscrew that. Job should be good. And right, hose. That clunks in there. And she's completely empty of oil. Let's fill her up. Watch the old gauge. Cool, blimey. She's a thirsty old beast. Probably burns fuel and oil <laughs> in the same quantity. A lot like the old Alfa Romeos I used to drive. There we go. Beautiful. Out you come. And that is another prepped aircraft. Alright, let's get all this um, cap back on. Door closed. And we'll get the Bowser over here. Tidy workspace is a happy workspace. Right, oh, we just got a gun patch to put on. There we go, happy days. Uh, how are we looking? All good. Let's sign that one off then. Brilliant. So refill the coolant, refill the aircraft, set up the radio. Refill the oil, harmonize, ah, new machine guns. Perfect job. Happy days, we're up to 1937. Only a few years out, brilliant. Let's continue on. Okay, here we are, 3367. Uh, enemy contact at high altitude. One enemy fighter dam damaged. Uh, received a few shots. Uh, boost on for more than five minutes. Okay, so replace all the gun port patches. Check. Check pistons and rings. Okay, oh, bloody hell, okay. Refill the coolant, fuel the aircraft, patch all the bullet holes, rearm the machine guns, replace gun camera tape. Roger, roger. Right. Bullet holes are... The first thing we'll do then. Why does it feel like I've done this before? Okay. Oh, that's not bullet hole. Okay. Now, if, it, if these are the ones where we've got sneaky bullet holes under here, we definitely have done this job before. Zoom in a bit so I can have a little bit more accuracy with me old uh, riveting. Right, so we go into spy mode, or, or visibility, or check mode, whatever you call it. Inspect mode, that's probably the correct term. 
Let's have a look. Bullet holes on this side. Do we have bullet holes underneath? No. Okay, it's not the job I'm thinking of. It's not the job I'm thinking of. Good. Um, now, do I... Um, I need to remove the... Because um, these bullets... The bullet holes are coming that side and coming out this side. So it's pushing... Accumulator access patch. Oh, I've never seen that before. Obviously, we need to um, cut around the uh, the bent out bit of metal on this side from the exit wound, as it were, of the uh, of the bullet, and then we can patch them. Right. Good day. It's a couple more to do. Oh, look at that. That matches up beautifully. Bullet holes are done. Hooray! She's patched up. Excellent. What's next? Um, machine guns, gun camera tape. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, we're not on the clock anyway, so it doesn't matter. Let's uh, let's have a look at these piston rings then. Um, how's, let's get this done. Let's get the, the big bulky stuff done out of the way while we've got a bit of time. We get the top one off. Lovely, we'll get this side off. We need to get the bottom off, maybe. We get it off anyway. Get full access for our little hands. Good, right, let's have a no, 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 no. Okay. Stop that. Stop that. We're we're in dismantle mode. Right, let's um So we'll probably need to take the uh all these off. All the um HT leads off. Mission leads. Um, I'm guessing we'll probably take the lead off. Now remember we've got two assistants now, so we should fly through this. Uh, relatively to what we were doing last time. I'm wondering, do I need to do this? Is this why I need to do it? I think so, because to get that off. Or maybe not. I thought I needed to do that to... Um... I may have done that prematurely. Right, now this should this should fly by. Look at them coming out, look at that, you can hear the, all them, hear the little tin, we're putting in the little storage tin for the moment. Oh yeah, that's super quick. Oh, it's like a dream! Right, let's get this off. Yeah, it's a lot better, isn't it? That's far more manageable. Happy days. Right, then we'll get these. Lovely. Uh, do I do it? Do you want me to check all these? The valve should be okay, I would have thought. But we're here, so we might as well check them. They're coming out anyway, so they'll go into our inventory, won't they? But it's always nice to check them, just to give them a visual inspection. And that's, you know, it comes down to the, the things that, you know, the simple things that in, you do in everyday life now is like, you know, cleaning your car. If you let somebody else do it or you go to an automated one, then yeah, your car gets clean. But one of the good things about when you do clean your car yourself, it also gives you time to actually look at your car close up. Um, which is always good, right? 25 minutes left. Oh, we are on the clock. And we, and we do need to take the... Um, the exhaust off. I wasn't wrong. Okay. Um, air compressor needs to come off. How do we get that off? Oh, we need to take this bar off, do we? Okay, let's do some screws. Nice. Nice, 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 right, nice, excellent. So we'll get this side checked. Let's see how that is. Holy crap, and moly! Look at this. It's 
colour in the orange. And this is where the um, upgraded extra assistant will really come in handy. Got the bolts coming out. Wow. It's like poetry in motion. Motion. Can't even say it. I'm so excited. They're all coming out randomly. So that's obviously the way I selected them. Don't necessarily have to go back in the same order. Right. Lovely. Oh, okay. And... No, hang on. Let's get the... I'll put ignition wires off then. Oh blimey! I forgot how long it, how uh, long-winded this is. Right, uh, that needs to come out, and the screw, the sparky plugs need to come out. We've got spark plugs on this side, I guess. Can't see them. Yeah, uh, oh there they are. They are. They're hidden. They're hidden slightly, hidden from my view. Lovely, 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 lovely. Right, now that should come off. Yes. Off you come. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Right, and then we should be able to look at the pistons and the piston rings. Obviously he's worried that he's, he's potentially damaged them, having been at full boost for a uh, longer than advised. Nice, right. Let's go into inspect mode. So... They all look good, they look fine, they look fine. Uh, should we take them out? Oh, is it gasket I gotta take off? I didn't see that. There we go. Now we can have a proper look. Uh yes, we've got a couple of cracked piston ring. Oh we got a few of them actually. Look, that one is Uh so we've got the top one on that one, the bottom one on that one, and those ones. They have been up. That sun is right annoying. Those ones are okay, yeah. Right, so let's remove that one. Did that come off? Yeah, it did. That one. And that one. I can't imagine piston rings are repairable because they are literally what they are. No, unrepairable. Right, let's get some more piston rings in. Three piston rings, please. Champion 8. Let's have a look then. Let's get these installed. Lovely. And the rest of the pistons are all looking good, aren't they? Good. Right, let's get that on back on then. Let's get the gasket in. That on. All this bolted on. Champion. I'll do the same on this side. While that's doing that, can we start taking this off? That's oh, going to be queued up. Okay. We're getting there. We, as soon as we upgrade again, we'll get another resistant. And this will be coming off soon. There we go. Right, let's continue to build this then, if, if it's going to be um, a bit of a thing. Right, let's... Get these back on. Nice. Um, I think we're, we're doing good for time. I think we still got to rearm the guns. Do we have? I think we have. Do we have to harmonise them again? Did he say? I have to reread that. We'll get this going. Oh, missed some. There we go. Um, let's have a look at the tasks. No. Okay, it's just it's just a, a patch up. That's grand. That's grand. Okay, time is shouldn't be a problem then. Quite comfortable with that. All right, the rock and cover going on. Let's get the, um, the top bit on. Whatever that's called. Cover, cover. Yeah, it's brilliant. Right, and we got so we got spark plugs to put in. 
put the spark plugs in so I'm forever I'm terrible at forgetting them. We'll yeah, we'll leave the exhaust and everything. There's the roar of the spitfires so at last. Spark plug in. We'll wait until we've got the other um the other side done before we uh, bother putting the uh, the leads back on. Uh, what am I doing down here in the engine now? What what have you done to me? <laughs> What's happened? There we go. Okay, well, I'm back. Uh, let's get... Alright, let's get the spark plug back in then. Yeah, that little ghost image is very difficult it's to find your click spot then. There we go. That's right, this one here. Spark plug, and those two are in. Grand, right. Okay, let's... Um, Hydraulic pump back on. Air compressor. Whoop, whoop. Brilliant. Okay, we'll leave the rest for now. We'll come around the other side and uh, just walk into the propeller. Right, let's get the spark plugs out then. We know the score. Nice. All right. Uh, let's finish taking off the exhausts. Come on, let me do it. Okay, good. Right, there we go. Right, the exhausts are off. We'll take the sparkies out of this side. Oh, that needs to come off first. Okay. Oh, yes. Look at this. Monstrosity. Crikey. Ooh. Yeah, we've got to put that on the other side as well. Yes, I know, I know. Time consuming, time consuming. But I. We had the 25 minute um, gong, but we haven't really had a gong for 20 minutes. That's, has it been 5 minutes yet? I thought I would have thought it has been. I expect to be down, unless I just missed it, of course. I just missed it. That's, that's an entirely possible outcome. Right, they're off. Let's get this cover off. Why can't I get the cover off? What? Right. Oh, there you go. I had to deselect to reselect. Sometimes that's a bit of a thing. Just got to play around with it a little bit. Get it to work. There they go, boys. Right, then we need to do a quick rearm, which is probably the next longest task, I should imagine. Um, crikey! Yeah, this this would be really tight if you didn't have any added assistance to uh, speed the un unscrewing and bolting and stuff like that. Be forever in a day. Feels like that yet there already, but. Now we go, come on. It's looking grand. There we go. Uh, we'll just do a quick inspection of this as well. Takes a minute, but it's well worth it. Oops. Actually stop for long enough for it to register. All good. Right, my favourite bit. It's like Flash Gordon. Rocket ships taking off. Love it. Now oh, comes you. Um, oh, and you. And we'll get these off. Paint by numbers. Bid, bob, bid. Ah, 15 minutes. There we go. Okay. I must have missed the 20 minute one. I was going to say it's been longer than five minutes. Uh, so 15 minutes, yeah, I think we're good. I think we should be good on time. It's going to be a bit tight. We just need to keep the uh, momentum and the speed up, but I think we'll be okay. Right, gasket. And move that. There we go. Let's have a little inspection then. We got uh, everything looks okay apart from this um, piston here.
my clickability seems to have gone down right those ones are all okay those are, there's no red ones on there are they no good as he walks uh, can I repair that piston I wouldn't have thought so but you never know it's always worth checking no you can't so three piston rings and a piston please thank you shopkeep <laughs> Grand, right. Let's uh, let's get this back together then. You on bolt in? Oh, not bolt. It's a, it's a thingy. There we go. Pistons and rings have all been checked and confirmed good after replacements. There we go. Nice. Right, nice. Let's wait for that to all get screwed in. Can you see which ones have been screwed in there? It's a mystery to me. Right, you and oh, all looks good. All right, let's get these in. Oh, so satisfying that is. <laughs> I don't know why I just like it. Oh, that didn't go well. There we go. Right, that one in, get the cover on, all the sparks in, and we should be good to rebuild this engine. I think we're good. I think we are good. Happy days, happy days, here again. Should a weird thing to say during the war. That we come, lovely. Right, now we got to build these two bits up. Let's get the spark plugs in first, because we got better visibility and access to them at the moment. Oh, I didn't get the spark plug in that end. Look, I think I missed one up there. Look, I did. Oh, that would have been good. Always worth double checking that. Okay, get these ones in. So he's trying to trying to find the the bite or the correct click point for the uh, everything else going on all around the the good ghost imagey things for connections. One two one two one two and get that bolted in there. Lovely. Let's get that in. One there. One there. Two there. Two there. Two there. Two there. One there. One there. Lovely. Get those bolted in there, champion. That's all looking good. Uh, let's get these on then with the Brazilian bolts. Not actually from Brazil, but just millions of them. Look at that! Crikey. This is the time consuming bit, so yeah, we will definitely get a couple more assistants. I think we've got some good skills. When it comes to identifying things, see that we we got the piston and uh, the piston skill, and you can see straight away we didn't have to look at the pistons. They were they came up with good, bad, and the piston rings likewise. So, yeah, now I'm pretty pleased we got that skill because that's certainly saving us a bit of time. And we can have a look at the piston rings at a glance and see if they need any work, and that's a hell of a time saver right there. Right, we'll just quickly get that one back on, get the exhaust on, and I think we can put this engine. Um, covers back on. I think that's about it, isn't it? Still going in. Yeah, so I want to get some live streaming done, but oh my goodness, I'm so busy. Hopefully next week I'll get some chance to sort of stop and do some stuff for myself. I'm Well, I say that, I'm doing stuff for myself as well. I don't know why I said that like that. Ten minutes. Uh, what have I done in this week and I've been off? My relaxing week. Well, I've dug a pond, lined it, filled it, and put the stuff around it, so that's looking pretty sweet. So we've got a pond in the garden now. Back-breaking work. I, uh... What else have I done? It feels like I've done... Oh, yeah, we've, we've done a whole raised veggie plot in the back garden. Um, planted all that with our 
veg, so we get some leeks and potatoes and carrots and all sorts of good stuff. Um, come spring and oh, or summer and autumn, I got onions in and all that, all that good stuff. Um, what else have we done? I feel like we've been hectic. I've been to doggy school as always, and um, spent a day clearing the shed up to a, a point where you couldn't actually get in the shed. It was that cramped. Um, so I've, uh, I took all things out, chucked a load of stuff out, sorted it, made things to hang on the walls and all stuff like that. And you can now, it's a properly neat looking shed now. I'm really pleased. That was a day well spent. Um, also, I've got to do some rotten windowsills. I've, uh, I've cleaned them off and cut all of the rot out. Um, some of them I can just fill and, uh, and patch that way. Another one I'm just going to have to completely do a new uh, subseal. So I've got all that, and I've got the cutters and, uh, and stuff, and we're good to go with that. Um, yeah, it doesn't feel like too much time, but I, I spent so much time doing stuff. DIY stuff around the house, that's what it's been. And to be honest with you, I don't mind doing that. It feels really rewarding, more so than working in your day job. At least, you know, you're doing it for yourself. And at the end of the day, you always feel like, you know, ah, I've actually achieved something there, rather than just made the company some money. <laughs> it's, it's a sad state of affairs, isn't it? But there we go. Yeah, I'd love to do it full time. Yeah, do up houses, old houses, and uh, renovate them and sell them. I'd love to do that. But yeah, it's a huge, it's a huge effort to do things like that. And you know, it's not always convenient with money and, and stuff like that, and family and moving around all the time. But you know, thought, food for thought, food for thought. I quite like, I quite like that kind of stuff. I do, making things work. There we go, champion. Right, another one, another job done. Out you come. Thanks, Steve. Off you pop. Brill. Thanks very much. Right, let's get some coolant. Oh, it doesn't let you do anything when you've got this coolant in your hands. That's really annoying. Nope. Oh, that's coming out. We'll grab the coolant again. Back we come. Pop you in and top this up. Oh, I don't know if he's got a, a full can is going to be enough. Yes, it is. Nice. Pop you down there. Uh, pop that in first. Pop that down. Pop. Oh, pop that in. Pop that down. Good. Um, tick tick tick. Place the gun for patch. It's not a problem. Rearm the machine guns. Replace the gun camera tape. Right. Okay. Let's get this done then. Out you come, in you go. Another job done. Right, so the guns. Let's get these off. Now we had this down to uh, some good speed last time, didn't we? So let's try and keep our um, breaches up. Nice. Good. I'll do the same on this side. Get up there, lovely. Um, don't really need that ladder anymore for this. Reach up. And last one on this side. Good stuff. Right, let's go. On. Hop off here. Get underneath. Right, uh, so this gun. Can we get the boxes? Oh yeah, we've got this little catch here. There we go. So we get the ammo out. That does need to come off. It's a shame. Five minutes left. Oh crikey, this is tighter than I thought it was going to be. Don't panic. Don't panic, Mr. Mannering. Yeah, that is a bit of a... That's quite a tight... 
time frame, isn't it? Hopefully we should be okay though. Let's get this ladder out of the way. Right, so we need that off. We need that open. We need you off. And get you two out. Oh, the clock's ticking now. Was this? I think this is the last job though, isn't it? I can't think of anything else we need to do. Please say there's nothing more we need to do. Good. Right. Let's get these fuel. These fuel. These um, ammo boxes refilled. And get these installed. Right. Click, click, click. You're in. You're in. Down. Close, close. Close, close. Close. Ammo you. In. You. In. Close. Bip, bip. And do, 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 do. Lovely. Right, let's get the... Those on. And let's get these ammo boxes installed. Get that down. Lovely. Lovely. Right, next one. Let's get these ammo boxes installed. Race against time. Would not, when it comes down to five minutes, it would be good if we had a little clock in the corner where we could actually see the, the minutes ticking down because I know you know you got less than five minutes. You don't really know exactly how long how long you got left. I guess it doesn't matter. You know, if you if you're busy at this point, you're busy. Right, let's get the ammo in. Breach down. Cap on. Lovely. Right. Um, ammo. Ammo in, ammo in, breach down, breach down. And ammo in, breach down. Oh, hang on. Ah! My clicking ability isn't really working. All gun port. Right. Rearm the machine guns. I have done. Oh no! Which one didn't rearm properly? Hang on. That one's okay. Oh no! You're kidding me. I've, have I missed one? Did the ammo not go in? Oh crikey! No. Yeah, that's in. Oh, we've we, we've we've just done something too quick. We haven't really. Is it that one? No. Okay. It's not this wing. Let's have a quick check underneath. Did I do all that? Oh no. Oh, I haven't done. Oh, one minute left. I haven't done it on this side. That's why. Oh my goodness. I thought I, I was done. Oh goodness! Okay, we got we've got a minute to do all these. Oh, run away! Ammo in, breach down. Ammo in, breach down. Don't panic, Mr. Mannering. Don't panic. All tasks complete. Nice. Woo! Done. <laughs> oh, that was cutting it fine. So all. Replace all gun port patches, done. Check pistons and rings, done. Refill the coolant, refill the aircraft, patch all the bullet holes, rearm the machine guns, replace the gun camera. Perfect job. Crikey! And we move to 2002. Right, we'll leave it there. That's enough for my poor nerves and heart to take for this time. Uh, join us next time as we progress on to further adventures and working with our pilot to uh, overcome... Any issues K9923 may suffer. Uh, so yeah, I hope you look forward to that. Hit that thumbs up if you want to see some more. And I'll see you next time.